I thought I'd do a video on why I moved to Leeds. Well, uni, short video. But there's a bit more to it than that. Why did I stay in Leeds? Why didn't I move back down south, try and get a job in London or something like that? Well, that's what this video is about. Me telling you a little bit about why I live in Leeds. Now, if you're from the south, you might not have been up north before. It seems a bit daunting, doesn't it? It seems a bit scary, but trust me, it's actually a lovely place. I love Leeds, I really get behind it. There's lots to do here. Interesting, loads of history, and it's diverse. Now, I don't just mean in like population terms. I mean, Leeds is a place, there's lots going on. I find it to be a sort of like less offensive London, Leeds. And that's how I describe it to people. It's, you know, it's, it's big enough so you don't get bored, create a little new life. And after I finished uni, I guess I didn't really know where I wanted to be. My original plan was to live in Singapore, where I grew up, but then COVID happened and, you know, that didn't make much sense anymore. It wouldn't have been a viable plan. So I was like, right, I'm gonna stay in Leeds. Now the biggest bonus that I can see about living here is it's a lot cheaper than the South. Like my rent, I live LS1, city centre. Yeah, I pay 550 quid a month. <laughs> Bargain. You would not be able to get a room in a shared house in London for that. Not a chance in hell. Rent here is cheap. Property prices, if you want to buy it here, are cheap. You can buy a five bed house here for 200 grand that you can rent out on an 11% yield. That is some crazy figures. Honestly, if you, if you said to someone down south, you can get 11% yield, on a property, they'd laugh at you and call you insane. But in Leeds, perfectly fine. Number two, I kind of like Yorkshire people, you know? They've got this, they've got this almost rude dryness to them. There's just a bit, you know, it's a bit more natural than that forced southern attitude. Do you know what I mean? Do you get that? I like the people. Here. I've always thought that, like even when I was at uni here, a lot of my friends weren't students, local people that lived here. Through music and that, that's how I get to know them. And it's always been nice. I'm trying to make sure I don't fall in now. So down here, this is Granary Wharf. Nice place. I'd like to have a little boat like that and just chill down here, for, I think. Maybe that's next. Maybe I don't want to buy a house, maybe I want to buy a boat. I bet this isn't what you thought Leeds would look like though. But it wasn't when I moved here. I thought it was just going to be grey. <laughs> grey and northern and scary. No, not at all, not at all. That's not what it's like here. Come. You don't half get weird looks, right? When you're talking to yourself, I've got this big fucking setup on the camera, right? I've got the, the, the long stick and the, the dead cat. So it does look like I'm doing something suspicious. Wow, look at that boat, man. I really rate this building, right? It's called the, the candlestick or something like that. The candle. It does look like a candle, doesn't it? It's mad. I love that sort of architecture. I don't know what you call it, someone tell me. That's what I was on about. The diversity of Leeds, the architecture here. Right, you go from city centre where it's all like old, grand, beautiful buildings to the new glass skyscrapers that, that do rival like major European cities. It's, it's lovely here. I mean, look, look at that. So after uni, after I realised I wasn't going to be moving to Singapore, hunkered down in Leeds and I was like, right, Leeds is a pretty good place to try and be an entrepreneur. You know, it's, it's a good place to sample my little business ventures and see how they flourish, because it's not expensive to live here. Now that's, to be honest, that's my number one of why I like Leeds so much, because it's pretty damn cheap compared to like southern cities. I know nothing's open at the moment, but when things are, you're looking at three quid pints, you're looking at four pounds for a takeaway on your way home from the pints, and as I mentioned, you know, rent. So when you're, when you're young, especially, right, this is a great place to just try out and, and, and start a life. You know, I've, I've really enjoyed my time here. And you just have to remember, right, if you're a southerner, the north is not this scary place that your parents probably think it is. It's fucking pain, man. 
I've always said if I didn't go to uni in the north, I probably would have never come up here. You know, places like Grimsby and Blackpool, you know, Sheffield, they sound a little bit scary, don't they? But in reality, it's all very nice here. I go kayaking on here sometimes. Um, I'm not sure if you're allowed, but no one's stopped me yet. It's quite fun. I like it around here. It's just, you know, calming all the water. I like to be near the water. Why else I like Leeds? There's a fucking airport. And it's like five minutes away. Brilliant. Not like London where it's a half an hour trek. It's a lovely place, you know? I find that being up north, right, you get the connections to all the other northern cities. They're all very close together. Manchester, Sheffield, Leeds, Newcastle, Liverpool. They're all close together. So, you know, you enjoy where you are. You're sort of more free to go around and see all these places that, that are actually amazing. And they really are. They're lovely, lovely places. My recommendation for today, maybe move up north. I've said that to lots of my friends. I'm like, hey, you should probably move up north. And they're like, why the fuck would I want to do that? I go, it's a nice place. Leeds especially. I speak very highly of Leeds to everyone. Oh yeah, it's a little postscript. Let me show you this finance company that looks like a strip club. This is funny. Now, that is the tackiest fucking staircase and office I have ever seen in my life. And they claim to be a finance company. Look, they've even got the logo on the stairs. How pretentious is that? That's almost London. And that's Leeds, almost London. 